Recent cases of students bringing weapons to school prompted the district to propose new regulations for students to improve safety. KUJH reporter Andrew Collins takes a look at which regulations are in place and what is being proposed to the district. On a typical day in Lawrence High School, students probably think about what they're going to do after school. But many parents, like Christina Grammer, are worried about safety inside the school. I feel like um, with all the guns being found in the school is really a bit starting to become a problem. Um, I feel like, you know, they definitely need to do some more um, security uh, me measures to keep everybody safe. In less than a month, both Free State and Lawrence High Schools had students bring weapons to the school in their backpacks. The shock of these separate but related incidents prompted the board to create community conversations with parents and students at both schools involving safety. The meetings resulted in both long-term and short-term ideas to improve safety. Lawrence Public Schools Executive Director of Communications Julie Boyle says the immediate plans are to build trust between students, parents, and the schools. A lot of the things that we're looking into and we can do immediately are more of adaptive solutions, um, making sure uh, that there's a caring adult in the life of every student in the school, that they have strong relationships. The adaptive solution ensures the students have an adult within the school they can trust. As for the long-term solutions, the board is reaching out to other districts to research effectiveness of metal detectors, clear bags, and student ID cards. In Lawrence, Andrew Collins, KUJH News. The district says they are researching the long-term plan of clear bags and metal detectors for effectiveness, cost appearance, and durability.